Hello, welcome to this video tutorial. This video tutorial is all about variables in Python, Python programming. It is very important to understand why variables in Python is important. So first of all, we have to understand what is variable. So variables are actually like a containers for storing data values uh, in Python program. Variables are created when you assign a value to them. Uh, here you can see that uh, I have given age as a variable and 23 as a value for that variable age, variable called age, right? So age is equal to 23. That is a statement I, I have assigned to Python where age is, a, age is called variable it's a string type variable and 23 is a value of that particular age variable right so equal sign is like operator so we can understand that variable is variables are containers for storing data that means 23 is storing uh, in age variable so there are you know certain uh, rules uh, when we need to when we're having uh, or naming variable we have to follow some rules uh, variables must start with a letter or underscore character variables can obtain letters numbers and underscore variables names are case sensitive variables names should be descriptive and meaningful of course and avoid using keywords like if true uh class etc as a variable names because you know in python built into uh, built in functions there are many kind of many types of keywords already you know uh in python so that if you if you you know assign variables name or if you write or naming variables name like this uh, uh, the python interpreter will you know throw you throw you I mean interpreter will throw errors so that it it cannot run okay so we should understand variable must start with the letter or underscore so we cannot have a space between two words if you are given a specific name later on we can have this uh, kind of real example I will show you for now let's go to variable types Python has several built-in variable types, including integers, uh, floating point numbers. Also, we can call this float, strings. Uh, in short form, we can write str and booleans, bool, uh, also lists, uh, and tuple, and dictionaries, dictionaries. So you can also create your own custom variable types, but that variable should not, you know, uh, naming uh, or contrast with keywords that already in Python right so let's go to the real tutorial so that you can easily understand okay let's have a Python variable example as we already talk about this variables types naming uh, rules and all that I want to review I would like to review so that you can easily understand here uh, you can see there is is a kind of variable here. We can call a string variable and equal is uh, This equal is operator and this 23 is a value to variable age Variable called age, right? So age equal to 23 here age is variable 23 is a value to variable and equal is uh, equal is operator right so operate operators or operating sign so uh, later on we can we, we will discuss about that so for now you have to understand that variable is this one this is there are many types of variable uh, as we already mentioned that integer variable boolean and also we have a string and some other types of variables right variables data type so 
uh, later on we can uh, go deeply for now you just understand you try we, we we try to understand that age is a variable and 23 is a value to variable a called age an equal is operator so in a second example here a is 15 I give value for the variable B is equal to 15.40 so I just uh, assign Python to print a plus B which is which comes 30.4 right this is how variable we assign variable or naming variables so what we understand what we have to understand here is a variable name consists of alphabets A to Z or capital letter A to Z or digit 0 to 9 and you can't start a variable name with a digit something like if I if I do like to age is equal to sorry is equal to 15 and to b is equal to 15.40 print a plus b if i run it will surely will throw error because why because we can't start a variable name with a digit because 2 is digit here so we can't start a variable name digit right so it will not work so there is a problem so that we can't do that and this is how we understand so another thing is that um, if you want to create a variable name having two or more words then you have to uh, you have to consider underscore in between for example my underscore age is equal to my underscore age equal to 23 for example print my age 23 right what will happen if we just remove uh, underscore of course it will not work because we have rules that we can't put a space in between variables I mean words right yeah see so it is throwing error so good variable name is that um, I'd like to mention here that for example my age is equal to 23 or we can also do my age it will print out my age so this is the good practice I mean this one is the good practice to name the variable not capital letter as well but underscore but in a small lowercase right so this is good practice so there is another thing you should understand that uh, in Python we also call literal some raw data literally is a raw data used for representing fixed value for example if we put like you know number is equal to 4.5 print number and run it 4.5 this value uh, of variable called number is 4.5 so this is called literal okay so later on in the in the next videos we can we can discuss about this so we'll learn about this numeric string and boolean literals in details in the next videos however in these videos we are just trying to understand the you know uh, naming of variables or variables name so uh, for example string string literal uh, we will have you know uh, in Python we will have also numeric literal and you know uh, boolean literal and also there are many other types of uh, variables so in the next videos we can learn uh, about them for now this is all for now in this video I hope you enjoyed it Thank you very much.